Hello, my name is Jimmy Costello from the NX product marketing team, and today we're going to be looking at how to create parts and drawings with Team Center inside of NX. This process as a whole is similar to how we would typically create new parts and drawings, although there are a few extra things to pay attention to. To begin, I'm going to navigate over and select File, New, and then Item. Doing this will open the traditional template window. Here, we can immediately notice a few extra wrinkles. One of the first things you should pay attention to is the Projects button found under Other Parameters. This is unique to when Team Center is inside of NX and will dictate what project our new file will be a part of. Once that is set, the next thing we can do is select the name and attributes for our new part. Double clicking the red asterisk will auto assign the item and revision IDs. This will honor the naming rules defined in Team Center. If you have additional attributes mapped to Team Center, these can be edited from the secondary attributes window. With this finished, we can now open our new part by selecting OK. To create drawings from our new part, once again we should navigate to File, New, and then Item. Similar to how we created our part, once again the drawing uses an ordinary template, though there are a few extra things to pay attention to. The most important difference for working with Team Center inside of NX is this relationship column here in the middle. For each size template, we have the option to choose if it will be a specification or master drawing. The specification relationship will create the drawing data set under the same item revision as the design. On the other hand, the master relationship will create its own item revision, which will be separate from the design item revision. Each option offers its own benefits, so it's up to you to decide what is most appropriate for your business process. Again, we can automatically assign our item ID, revision, and name, and then we are ready to begin working on our new drawing. In conclusion, in this video, we've explored how to create designs and drawings with Team Center inside of NX. Specifically, we explored assigning new parts and drawings to existing projects, generating names and attributes for new files, and the relationships drawings have with their item revisions. I would like to thank you for your time and attention.